Hi, welcome to my home. I'm Chef Carl Fotos Barrera. Here's Carly. And today we're making baked brie. Chef Carl, food whisperer, taking the mystery out of cooking. Okay, what I'm going to do is, is this is the finished product. I'm going to cut into it and I'm going to show you how this is good for the holidays. And you'll see. You can have, use it with crackers. This oozy, 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 delicious. It's like a piece of pie, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna put this on the side for a second. And we'll taste it, it's pretty hot so, now. I don't wear gloves, I have sanitizer here with a rag, I get soapy water with a rag, and I wash my hands, and I sanitize the board. And I'm going to take puff pastry. I just buy this at the store. This is, happens to be Pillsbury, but you can use any kind you want. And it comes folded up, so you, you roll it out a little bit because you want to mend the seams. Now, the first braid that I did was a little large, so if you're only having a small gathering, you're uh, going to use a smaller one like this. You can buy this in most of any of your stores, has free. Comes wrapped up like a Christmas present. Now, you don't peel the rind off, you leave it on. First thing we're going to do, we're going to put down some brown sugar right in the center. Then I'm going to cut off some of the end pieces because you don't want to have too much dough. Then we're going to put some nice blackberry fruit, fruit spread or orange marmalade, whatever you'd like to have. The first one I made, I used orange marmalade. Then you put some candied pecans or walnuts, and I chopped some so. They're not quite as big. All right. Okay, we put the brie in the center. You start bringing up the sides. Then we're taking the scraps that I made. Cutting them. And they're going to look like leaves when they puff up. Or you can just leave it like it is if you don't want to get too fancy. The other thing you can do is take a piece of the dough Try to make a cone out of it. Piece of dough here, piece of dough there, there a dough, there a dough, everywhere a dough dough. And don't say yes, Chef Carl, you're a dough dough. And you put a flower right in the center. You put the parchment paper underneath, and then you spray it with egg wash. Uh, hop the brown, and that's it. And when it comes out, this is a bigger one. You'll have something that looks like this. Well, I hope you learned something. And you can also put the baked brie or the brie in a little ramekin and make it like a cream bolle, and just bake it and then put some caramel and honey and pecans or walnuts on and bake it at 375. The big one I had actually at 390. 
because it was so big and that needed to brown it. So thank you for joining me. Thank you for coming into my home. And we'll see you next time. And peace.